Hi folks, welcome back to the channel GoCar India. I'm your host Rohit. Today we're going to talk about the all new launch from the house of Hyundai. This is the all new Creta. Why I'm saying all new Creta? Because this is a new variant that is the adventure variant. So this particular variant has been launched just now. So in this video, we are going to talk about all its new features that has been added over here. There are a few cosmetic features and interiors that we're going to discuss in this video. So watch this video up till the end and I hope you will like it. If you like it, definitely like, share, comment and subscribe to the channel. Let's start the video. First, let us have a look at its front. The major changes are on its grill. If you see, the grill is given totally in black in color. Piano black finish is looking really good. And even the Hyundai logo has been changed into piano black. And if you see the bumper, bumper remains the same, but then you get black highlighting accents over here, which used to be in silver in color earlier. So the skid plates have been turned totally into black. Looks really good. You get the same headlamps, the trio beam headlamps. It remains the same, but with this particular color, if you see the black and white dual tone effect is looking really good on this particular car from the front and even at the sides as well. So front, again, the look remains the same. Everything else remains the same. The major changes are on the grill. So these are the changes over here. So let us move on to the sides. The first thing that you're going to see is the new alloy wheels. So these are full black out alloy wheels with red calipers. So this looks really sporty actually. Uh, and it is an adventure variant, right? So you need to add some bit of sportiness over there. So that is what they have done. Looks very good. Tire size is 215-60 R17. So 17 inches alloy wheels is what you're going to get. You get these wheel arches over here, which used to be earlier as well. But the change is this here, adventure variant. So this adventure branding has been added and this particular thing has been added, which is looking very good. Next thing that has been changed is this, this cladding that you see over here on the doors has been added. Looks again different and looks very sportier from the side. This particular footstep has been added as a part of accessory. It is not with the car, basically, that you need to uh, purchase it separately. ORVMs have been turned into black. So these used to be body colored earlier, but now they have totally turned into black with sight and indicators, which look really good. Now the major changes over here, you see this design element that has been added, right? So this particular used to be in silver color earlier. Now they have changed it into black color. So when you see, when you see at the side, it uh, gives you a dual tone effect over here because it is white and black. So looks really good. Roof rails also are there, which are again given in black in color. Looks good. Again, everything else remains same and constant over here. Now let us move on to the rear and see the changes. On the rear, if you see, you get shark fin antenna that is given in black in color and the spoiler with black spats, which looks really good. Again, this is adding a lot of character over here from the back. You get high stop lamp over here, wiper washer defogger, all this you'll get. Uh, Hyundai branding, Creta branding and SX branding. And if you see these letters, right, it is in dark chrome color. So that has been uh, some difference that has been added over here. If you see the bumper, bumper you get reverse sensors and skid plates that are given in black. You get a camera over here. Now you can have a look at its boot space. You get quite a huge boot space. You can keep uh, three, four bags easily over here, suitcases as well. Here if you see, you get toolkit and spare wheel. So this spare wheel is of 16 inches. So it is a space saver spare wheel. So that is all it is from here. Now let us get into its interiors. Before that, let us come on to the passenger side. On the passenger side, the look remains same and constant. One good thing about this particular car I like is all the four disc brakes are given. So all the tires get four disc brakes. So that is a big, big thumbs up. And right now, all its dimensions will be flashing on your screen. So now that the exteriors are done, let us move on to its interiors and see how it looks like. So the major changes is what you're going to look into the interiors actually. So the first thing that you see is this full door panel that has been in black color now. So previously it used to be in dual color. Uh, there was beige and grayish combination or something like that. But now it is totally in black. Four door power windows, lock on lock switch and volume controls. You get all of those over here. You get bottle holders and speaker vents. So this is what it looks like. But here if you see you get uh, light as well, interior lighting. So you get some light lighting bits over here, ambient light. The next thing that has been added is door skid plate over here and the major change is this. If you see, you get 3D mats here also adventure is written. So this adventure branded 3D mats and the metal pedals. You see all these pedals are metal. So these are the differences over here. Now let us talk about the seats. Seats are same, the old ones, but the only thing is the way it looks like, right? So they have uh, given in dual tone color. So you get green khaki color 
and black color and this design element has been changed looks very good so here if you see you get some leather bits and then fabric bits so looks very nice and there is some kind of character that has been added with these new design seats and next the seat comfort remains the same it is it has been always been a really good highway rider or city rider you are going to enjoy the comfort of these seats and you are going to feel at home definitely so that is what it is over here now let us move on to its main interiors now let us have a look at this dashboard so dashboard if you see has been changed from earlier uh, kratas so here you are going to get full black in color dashboard so one color monotone color which is looking really good but then there are highlighting access that has been added to the ac vents so these are like khaki color ac vents looks really good the highlights have been added very nicely in this particular interiors if you see here you are going to get a good ambient light uh, this particular variant is going to come with six airbags so that is good on safety as well you get uh, this touchscreen music system with android auto apple carplay navigation all the other information is given over here you get ac controls so these are auto climatic ac controls over here you get wireless charging pad 12 volt charging socket usb so all these are given over here you get a six speed manual gearbox in this particular variant you get automatic as well both the gearbox options are available over here you get driver rear view monitoring system button over here two cup holders and armrest uh, it is quite a deep armrest there are a lot of things over here you can put now let us talk about the next major change that is this dash cam you get dual camera dash cam so you're going to see what is happening at the outside as well as the interiors so it records both the views which is really good irvm which is manually adjustable but it gets blurring connectivity and everything else over there sunglass holder white lights which is really good and your sunroof controls over here you're going to get ticket holder and vanity mirror now let us have a look at a steering wheel steering wheel uh, remains the same the same old steering wheel but then looks really good because now they have added this highlighted accents of green color so looks that looks really different you get audio and call controls over here and uh, a cruise control so that is what is given now let us move on to its instrument cluster you are going to get a normal instrument cluster in this that is analog at the top end you are going to get digital but here it is analog uh, speedometer tachometer and big mid screen is there so that is what you're going to get over there you get wiper stocks and light stocks on the driver side if you see you get driver uh, ac vents you're going to get engine start stop button auto on off button traction control switch and headlight leveling switch so these are the things that you're going to get over here uh, that is what it is from the interiors it looks really plush and nice and these highlighting accents are the thing to talk about in this particular interiors right now now let us go to the back and see what are all the features you're going to get did you hear the third quite good right okay so uh, let us talk about the interiors first at the rear the seats are very comfortable to sit and like i showed you in the front the dual tone seats are looking really good and very comfortable to sit and enjoy three people can sit over here easily and you get this as an armrest as well armrest with two cup holders so that option also is there apart from that if you see here you're going to get ac vents with highlighting accents you get phone charger as well that is there uh, you get these mats over here as well so the 3d mats are added at the back as well so which is very good uh, good headroom one thing that i like about over here is this light this reading light and next thing is this privacy blind so these are two superb things or two super features that i like in this particular car when you sit at the air uh, so yeah that is what it is very comfortable seats to enjoy your ride now let us talk about this engine option so this particular variant is going to come only in petrol engine so you are going to get four cylinder 1.5 liter petrol engine which is one of the best in the segments i can say you get somewhere around 15 to 17 mileage in this particular car in the highways so it is very good and this particular variant will be only with petrol engine not with the diesel so if you want diesel in this particular adventure variant you will have to go for alcazar it is not there in creta so just you need to be mindful of that so folks i hope you would have liked this video if you have liked this video definitely like share comment and subscribe to the channel go car india it's a new channel do send in some love do subscribe to the channel and let us hit that 10k mark soon if you're from bangalore and if you want to purchase this car you can definitely come down to trident hyundai old airport road their address information and all the other contact details are given in the description box below until our next video drive safe be safe be responsible peace bye